Hey friends, I am so excited to bring this unboxing to you. This beautiful Christmas box is from Needlecraft Corner. And it says, North Pole just for you to Teresa from Santa Claus. It's so adorable. I have a note from Drama that she wanted me to uh, read to you about the box. So she said, this has been truly a labor of love to create my first Christmas box. I want to thank Teresa for being our host and also for creating a gorgeous Christmas chart. I also want to thank my shop elves, Sue, Judy, and Debbie. In addition, I want to thank my Christmas helpers, Sharon, Marsha, Sarah, and Pam for creating many of the beautiful items you have just received. In addition, my thanks goes out to Stitches by Ethel, Hand Dyed Fabrics by Steph, Seraphim Fabrics, Waxing Moon, Tra La La, and Jan Hicks for their wonderful charts. Thanks to all who purchased the box. Hope you will return for our spring surprise box. Merry Christmas. Okay, guys. I think I am just as excited as you are to see what's in this box. Here we go. Oh my gosh. She must have known that I love the Grinch. Hold on, let me push that all the way back so it stays open. Okay. So this is not, this is not your, like an advent box. This is not something that you open one present a day. This is something that you just open all at once when it arrives at your house. Look how cute. This is Merry Christmas, 12 days from Santa. How cute is that stocking? And look, the Grinch. I love the Grinch. Okay, so I'm just kind of looking through first. Okay, so I'm going to do this and I'm going to save the stocking for last. I don't know about you, but in our household, the stocking is the first thing to be open. Like everyone likes to do the stocking first, but I'm going to save it for last. Hopefully that's okay. <laughs> Ooh, look at this beautiful fabric. 32 count winter white by Seraphim. Look how pretty. A beautiful neutral color. Love it. Very nice. Look at the puppy dogs. So cute. Don't you just love Christmas wrapping paper? Oh, so fun. Oh, geez. Geez, I recognize that logo. <laughs> this is my contribution called Santa's Friends snowman with the penguin and a little reindeer super fun I need to stitch that <laughs> look at this Grinch paper oh I love it I mean if you could see my face like I have a grin from ear to ear right now Grinchmas, I love this. this. Oh my gosh, look at you guys. Look how adorable that zipper pull is. It's the happy Grinch. <laughs> wow, this is awesome. This must have been one of the handmade items that she was talking about. 32 Belfast linen or even we got. That's pretty paper too. You know, these unboxings, they're a lot of work for these shops and for people to put together. And um, I do appreciate it because we know how it can be overwhelming when you commit to something like the Jingle Ball. <laughs> and um, you get caught off guard sometimes by how much work something is. Oh, isn't that beautiful? Oh, wow. Fully kitted. Stitches by Ethel. Look at that beautiful tree. It's called wintergreen. Let me take it out so you can see it. Oh, nice. You get the floss and the fabric. Look at that fabric. Beautiful color. That is still in plastic. 
Oh, and look. Oh my gosh, there's so many goodies in here. So here is a picture of wintergreen. Very cool. And then inside there is... Wow. Two super tiny seed beads and an adorable little holly leaf. Let's see if you can see that. Definitely keeping that in that bag. Even though her model is not stitched, or maybe her model is stitched on that fabric. You know how photography can be. It is tricky, very tricky, because I was gonna say it looks like it's stitched on more of a tan color, but the more I look at it, it has that kind of modeling in it. So, model stitched on 28 count friendship green. I gotta put all this back in here, guys. I might just skip forward on this part so you don't have to watch all that. Look at that. Stitches by Ethel. It's called Freezy by Ethel. Oh, how cute. Look at his little face. Oh, how cute. And you, oh, he's tiny because he fits inside of that. Wow, nice. So this is linen. It looks like it's a full kit as well. Wow, you get everything you need to make it. How nice. You have all the floss on these adorable little floss straps. Super cute. Some little, um, what is that called? Treasure braid. And your fabric. And then your chart. How adorable. It's funny because when I was looking at this, I was thinking it was going to be like this big around. He's going to be tiny and adorable. You get the trim and everything. Very cool. Thank you so much. This is fun. Next, we have Waxing Moon Designs Christmas Pounds. When what to my wondering eyes did appear but 10 extra pounds on my thighs and rear. That's hilarious. Oh my gosh, I love that. I'm gonna take it out so you can see it a little bit better. That is so funny, I love that. Very, very cute. Hers was stitched on 28 count country French latte. Stitch count is 96 by 145, so nice and doable. I mean, they're all doable, right? But I just meant a little bit smaller to get it done. You, I mean, someone that stitches a lot could get that done before Christmas. Not this girl. I don't get to stitch a lot. Oh, look at that. By Tra La La. Oh, how adorable. It's called Merry Christmas by Tra La La. Stitch count 89 by 92. Look how sweet that is. Looks like a flat fold little reindeer up in the cloud Santa very cute super cute next we have Jan Hicks creates stunning cross stitch designs vintage Christmas alphabet one. Oh, I love it so A for angel B for bell and C for candle let's see if I can do this without taking it out because that's tends to take a lot of time. Nope, doesn't look good that way. Ooh, and it's kitted. Gotta love that. What a fun chart, though, to go through the alphabet with Christmas words. Very cute. I love it. I love her fabric. I'm not sure what that fabric is, but I love that. Let's see. Affogato by Fiber on a Whim. All right. DMCs, gotta love it. There's just so much talent in this community. Some boxes have Oatmeal by Seraphim. 
that was laying at the bottom so I'm not sure what that is for if that was for Jan's it might be for Jan's oh and there's a gift certificate in here for ten dollars that's so so sweet okay now we have this adorable stocking full of sweet gifts first I don't know <laughs> I feel like a little kid look how cute that bag is they probably made that too how cute a little ort jar I love it with some skeins in there or a skein oh that's pretty Noel look at that I have not seen that before wow I wonder what that would stitch up like some blues and greens, red, gold. Very pretty. Cool. Cute little jar. The ort jar I have is almost full. And it's so cute because I don't even put my orts in my ort jar because that's what Ellery likes to do when she comes to our house on Thursdays. She picks up all my little threads and puts them in there for me. Isn't that the cutest thing ever? Oh, cashews. Mm, one of my favorite nuts. Love it. Thank you. What do we have here? I think I think this was in there. I have a feeling this pen was in there. But it fell out when I was taking everything out. Oh my gosh, look how cute this is. There's spools of thread on there. Isn't that adorable? That is really cute. I love that. Very cool. So clever. Everyone's just so clever. Or maybe this was in there. Or maybe both were in there. I don't know. But these are needles for our stitching for all these amazing projects we got. Floss pad. Oh my gosh. I love these. I, I use the floss away bags. That's how I keep when I'm doing a project. I don't use floss drops, I use these. And it comes with the ring. Super cool, love it, thank you so much. That'll come in handy for these projects. Oh, look at these pins, you guys. I gotta take them out so there's no glare. Oh, and the way they packaged it's really, really cute, too. Look at that. How cute are these pins? Wow, very nice. Oh, so sweet. needles magnetic needle keeper oh that's awesome keep your needles easy to find includes 224 tapestry needles very nice gotta love that put that in your project bag look how cute this is packaged oh my gosh that little reindeer is so adorable Ooh, a scissor fob. Look at that. Boy, these girls have been busy making all these things, huh? Oh, that's beautiful. I'm going to take it off this part. Isn't that beautiful? that. 
It says joy. A little snowman, but oh, it's so wintry. I love it. And just some silver scissors. Be beautiful. Very cool. Isn't this adorable? A scissor case. Oh, it's double sided. How cute. It says Merry Christmas, and then it has that cute little guy on there. What was his name? Little Freezy's on there. <laughs> but that's cute. Put your scissors in, or you could use it as a coin purse in your purse, too, if you wanted. Look how cute that um, zipper pull. Or zipper bling. I don't know. I don't know the names of these things, guys. Look how cute he is. Oh, <laughs> a needle minder. It says my favorite needle minder. And it's Mr. Freezy. How cute. Let's take it out there so you can see it. I love it when things coordinate like that. So cute. Look at all the work that goes into these. I mean, seriously. A lot of this is handmade. I mean, it's just incredible. Oh, this is cute. Needles and pen keepers with Mr. Freezy on it. Cute. Well, when you're stitching Mr. Freezy, you've got all the accoutrement to go with it. Place to put your scissors, a thing to put your needles in. I mean, oh, I love these. Do you guys use a needle threader? I do. It's just easier for me. It's way quicker and I'm all about speed when I when I get to stitch I don't have a lot of time to stitch so I don't want to fiddle with thread and needle when I can do it quickly with the threader super cute little tin I love that Oops. and last but not least I think I was supposed to do the stocking first because it was on top please forgive me I don't think it really matters but Oh, a highlighter guide. Oh, that's cool. Oh, this is static cling. Well, that's interesting. I've never used one of these, but it sure would be handy. Keeps your place without hiding the chart or text, so it's see-through. Perfect for cross-stitch, knitting, crochet, maps, recipes. How cool, three pieces. So this is the gist of it. Oh, here's the yellow one. Oh my gosh, it sticks right to the paper. These are fantastic. Have you guys ever seen those? Wow, those are cool. I'm assuming, <laughs> maybe I should have asked, but like, if you need to buy these, get a hold of Drama at Needlecraft Corner. She's gonna have these things in her shop. Like this, the floss packs she would have. Um, obviously, there's things like the patterns and things that are exclusive to this box that you can't purchase. But if you see anything here that you like, you know, you can always ask her and it might be things that they have in their shop. So that was absolutely amazing. Thank you so much, Drama, for asking me to be a part of your amazing Christmas box. I was honored to be a part of it and I was in good company with all these beautiful designers and, and, their, and all these amazing handcrafted accoutrement for stitching. Super cool. I so appreciate it. Let me just read you what she has to say about the spring box. Let me put things in here that are pretty to look at <laughs> while I'm reading. <laughs> How about we do that? Okay. 
She said, we had so much fun at Christmas that we are doing it again. This time the theme is a new spring because all of us would be ready for it after the long winter's nap. You choose whether you would like Ada, Lugana, or Linen. We provide 16 or 32 count fabric depending on what you choose. Inside the box? Well, it's a surprise. We'll tell you what there will be. Beautiful spring hand dyed fabrics, at least three different spring themed kits, spring charts, and handmade accessories celebrating different spring holidays. Peter Cottontail. Uh, wait. Nope. The cost is $225 including shipping within the U.S. International shipping will be charged at the going rate for the package. Payment is due when you reserve the box. How to sign up? Just call us at 443-725-7587, local and toll free, or email drama at needlecraftcorner.com and let us know. The deadline for signups is December 31st, 2023, and there's a limit of 75 boxes. It's first come, first served. We hope you'll join us to shake the winter blues for our spring box. Very cool. So yeah, you have all the information you need to sign up for the spring box. If you like what you saw here, it's going to be just as amazing. It'll just be spring. So again, thank you, Drama, and Merry Christmas. Don't forget, create every day.